Hey guys, my name is Chuck Gonzalez, and I'm the owner of CrossFit Hillsboro and Pacific Personal Training here in beautiful Hillsboro, Oregon. My friend and mentor, Sherry McMillan, um, reached out to me and asked if I could uh, help out with her session up there at IDEA. I want you to know that this is not a CrossFit bashing session. And I know I've kind of heard that before from uh, some other presenters out there who will remain nameless, uh, but Sherry's got a great heart and she's doing a really great thing. So thank you very much for asking me to be a part of this. We're gonna take you through a workout called Fight Gone Bad. I'm gonna show you just a little snippets of what we do in this workout. And we happen to have it programmed for this week and I just thought that it would be a great opportunity for you guys to see it. Maybe some of you guys have actually done it. I'll explain to you what the workout is in the video, um, but it's important that you guys know that just because somebody who comes into our facility is new does not mean that we're gonna throw them into this workout right off of the bat as it's prescribed or as we have it exactly written out. They might not be using a 14 pound medicine ball for the ladies, they might be using a four pound medicine ball. They might not be squatting all the way down on their wall ball, they might be doing power squats. So there's different ways that we can modify um, the exertion level, the intensity, and even the amount of volume that we have. We have a pretty good eye on our, uh, on our athletes, and uh, we'd like to think that we know what we're doing here. So I'll show you guys what we're gonna do. Have a good time up there in Seattle. I think I'm in the audience, aren't I? Hey Chuck. All right, thanks you guys. What'd you get, Dan? <laughs> What's up, bro? How'd you do? Oh, they're starting. Let's turn around and see what they're doing right here. All right, so they have one minute of what we call wall ball. And here's how we scale. We scale either the weight of the wall ball or their range of motion. Women hit nine feet, guys hit 10 feet. Garrett right over here is hitting the 10 foot mark. They're going to do this for one minute. Next, we're going to have a minute of the sumo dead high pull, a minute of box jumps, a minute of push press, and then they're finally going to row for calories for time. So it's a five minute workout that they got to go through three rounds of with a one minute break in between every round. So they're still going here. Now, how we score this is we track all of their reps. Let me get on Allie here. You better keep that ball going, Allie. We're dropping that ball for Come on. He's doing what we call the RX weight right here. But Kiersey, Kiersey is not quite there yet. So we're working on Kiersey's core strength first and her upper body strength on the sumo dead high pole. One minute of box jumps. They can get on top of the box any way they need to. Sometimes they're gonna save their knees and they're not gonna jump, they're just gonna step up and step down. It's like a super massively high step aerobics class. You're doing great. You're doing great. There you go, Rob. That a boy. There you go. Good rebound, Rob. Good rebound. Reduce your ground contact time. Make it fast. There you go. Pause on top of your box if you have to. Reduce that ground contact time. Boom. Hey, that's a little up. Uh, they're not even done yet. After they finish this, they're going to hit the road. But I'm sure that you want to get onto your presentation. So listen, Sherry, thank you very, very much. Uh, we're just trying to push our athletes and keep everybody very safe and very healthy. So hey, best of luck up there.